Hello everyone, it's Jeffrey with the Jay Saunders channel. What you're looking at here is my homemade flea trap. We got a bad flea problem here. Our cat got fleas and then she spread them all over the house and she's since been taken care of. We had to give her a really good bath and it wasn't just a bath. You've got to take the brush and keep pouring the warm water on and literally brush the eggs and the fleas off the body. It's the only way. The flea shampoo soap will not do it. The water will not do it. The fleas will not die. You have to brush them off. Anyway, we got that problem fixed with her, but the, now the house is full of fleas. And the warm weather is hitting here, so that's really bad. So we have this infestation. And this is after spraying a bedroom, which has hardwood floors with rugs thrown on it. Thank God this isn't just a huge carpet. And sprayed it, vacuumed it really well. And this is a day later, still I had fleas. So I decided to uh, put these up. And they're extremely effective. As far as I know, this is the only way to trap fleas. Non-toxic. This is a white plate, not blue. The camera makes it look blue, but this is all white. The whiter, the better. Uh, but it's a white plate. And you can see I've got a, a, a light here that I paid a dollar for. It's a dollar tree. Uh, it has a solar cell on the top that charges it during the day if you sit it in the sun. And a switch, so you can turn it on and off and the piece of paper. This is a white piece of paper. Anything white will do. Probably be better if it was the you know, the longer paper. Maybe wrap around, maybe this far. Something like that, you know. And uh, this is to be the only light source in the room. You put it on the floor in a strategic location. Make sure there's no other lights on. And this is after about an hour and a half. Just as evening came in, set in, I took a nap. When I woke up, here were about 30 fleas in here, and now there's about a hundred. It's been a couple hours later, and this is in a room that I thought I'd pretty much gotten every flea there was, but I still noticed there was a family and one here, one there, uh, and so I set three more of these up, and I've got about 30, 40 fleas in each one. So I did not get them all. And this is after spraying and vacuuming. So I figure after a couple of days they'll all jump in here for me and problem solved. But I'm going to always have one of these going, I think, all the time. I think I'm just going to have a permanent one. An enterprising person might make a kit with a light and a back plate, a little, some little plastic tray that folds open. You fill it with water and turn it on. And there you go. You're a millionaire overnight. Uh, but I'm too old and lazy to do it, so looks like you're going to have to do it. Here's a few more versions of this. Nice, pretty plate. You can set that. You can make this any way you want. Here's another one of those lights. Notice the all-important piece of paper back here. They see that. They're not going to see this. And they see the light, but when they see this, they just go nuts. They just want to jump on that piece of paper, and it just bams them right back into the water. So, and you can also use a candle too. If you set a candle right in the middle of this water here, so you don't have to worry about a fire, but right in the middle of a plate, right? You set it right in the middle on a little stand, you got your candle. And hopefully the paper won't fall onto the candle, so you do have to be careful. But it is fun with the candles because every once in a while you'll see a flea jump through the flame, you know, as his way to the paper there, and it looks like a little tiny meteorite. Very entertaining. And you'll even hear a pop sound once in a while as their little bodies explode. So here's the night light on the wall version. Basically crude setup here. I could probably do with a bigger plate. Uh, but they are attracted to this light and they'll come over here and just bask in the sun and they'll just get some sooner or later they end up in this plate. Uh, this is for outside. This is just outside on the patio here. Just I didn't even put bother to put white plates or anything. They see the light, they jump over here, and, and just inevitably they end up in these. In the <laughs> so, oh, and don't forget they are attracted to the light source. So, you know, cover up your doors like this if you don't want the fleas 
migrating towards your whatever room that is with the light on. So in my case I had a really bad case of fleas here because of the cat and the warm weather hitting and the eggs all over the place. This is, seems to be the only stuff that really works good, doesn't smell bad, and it's highly effective. Highly effective. I'm not out of, I don't even know what company this is unless it's Hot Shot, I guess. I don't know. But then, don't forget the source of the fleas, and that's the cat or your dog. Bath with brush and just keep on going. Change the water. Do everything you have to. Um, and these are drops. Now, I put these drops on, and I think for the first time in years, I haven't seen a flea on that cat for a week now. And I did see a couple. Well, I, I saw a couple, but they were dead. So, uh, this stuff really works. It's worth the money. I know that it costs money, but I've tried the, the powders, the sprays, the diatomaceous earth, everything. Well, this is the only thing that works on the animal. So, very important. Let's get the source of the fleas. So that's all I have to say about this. I hope it really helps somebody that has a flea problem. You know somebody. And even if you don't, like I say, you can set this up in your in your room, make a nice little better looking, you know, better something better looking than this. Uh, might be more portable, uh, any light source, uh, but the, the main idea you see is just the light. They see the white. It's the only light in the room, and they go for it. And by morning, you'll have a, a plate. Every flea in that room will probably be in here or near here. And it's going to take a couple of days. This isn't going to happen overnight. And uh, hopefully they haven't laid any eggs, but that's why you do want to spray. So... Uh, if you have a bad flea problem and then once you get rid of the flea problem you just want to keep one of these in the room just keep it there all the time this is free this cost me a dollar at the Dollar Tree this particular light I like it because everything's in the top and I can stand it right in the water here and it's free electricity forever all I do is sit it in the, in the window ledge charge up the battery and I'm ready to go again and if you want a longer lasting battery, you can always change the battery in here. This comes with a 100 uh, milliamp hour battery, but you, you can put a bigger battery, you know, a thousand milliwatt, milliamp hour batteries in there, you know, or even, uh, you know, have, should be rechargeable. But I notice you could put just a regular battery in here and forget putting it in the sun. And the regular battery will last days. And one last note is, I don't know if this really works in the daytime that much. I assume it does, but there's there's so much light that they might not see this light. So it's probably not as effective in the daytime. So if you do want to get the place, close the, you know, darken the room, okay? And, uh, okay, so good luck with the fleas. Have a good day.